Welcome to the Whiskey Vault. I'm Daniel. I am still Rex, and there's no... So we have a gift. Yes. From a friend who also happens to own the distillery. Okay. But one that you're gonna be really excited to try. So I have a question, first of all. Yeah. Colin Keegan. Uh-huh. So he's not, he's a rep, because he has, a, yeah, he's pretty reppy. <laughs> yeah, because so he owns the place. Here's your crickets. <sighs> All right, uh, this, you said he's a friend. Yeah, we know him. I mean, not, we're not like best buds. You know him. But we've talked. I'm sure and... he's a lovely man. Yeah. I don't, I've never met him. Yeah. yeah. Makes what we think is really great whiskey. I mean, I was, I'm not sure when this episode's coming out, but last weekend's episode on the Whiskey Tribe channel, we're going through the best whiskeys that you've probably never heard of. Heard, yeah. Never heard of. Uh, and... Uh, one of their bottles was on the list. Yeah. They make some super good stuff. Now yeah. my question to you is, if his name is Colin Keegan, you always say Cole Kagan. Yeah. Shouldn't it be pronounced Cole Keegan? I don't actually know. I just say Cole Keegan because that's what no, sounds you say good Cole, to me. You say Cole Kagan. Cole Kagan. I think it's Cole Keegan. You think it's Cole Keegan? I think it's Cole Keegan. I don't actually because know it's the Colin answer Keegan. Yeah, yeah. That would make sense. It's kind of like GIF and JIF. Yeah. Once you understand, it's like, Graphic, graphic in the face. It's GIF, yeah. yeah. Anyways, so uh, this is a small bottle though. It is. So I retract fully 15% of your crickets. <laughs> All right. So this is a bottle that was released only for their 10th anniversary. Oh, nice. They took their typical malt. Mm -hmm. This is the oldest one they've released to date, nice, by the way. Yes. Um, they, the first, they took two barrels that were in New American Oak mm -hmm. and were three years old, yeah. and they moved them into PX Sherry Barrels Ooh. Oh, for another year. Dude, I got some drops on the hand. Oh, like, yeah. You do this little oh, yeah. son of all of the bitches. Yeah. So, oh. and then they left it at 100 proof because the higher proof was held the body right. better. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. You do it. You do the thing. Oh, yeah. You do the thing. Oh man, that milk <laughs> chocolate yeah, yeah. oak, a hint of smoke. Oh man, do that on your hand, the milk chocolate. I'm the explodes. one who told you. Did you get the milk chocolate? Because <laughs> when you get a real amount instead of just on your fingertips, that's like solid Cadbury milk chocolate bar. Wow. That is just magnificent. Gotta try it. Okay, we haven't worked with him in an Alliance cask, but we're gonna. Okay. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead so, and ahead of time say that we have what's, interest in what's the thing him being you, good. Uh, full disclosure. Full yeah. disclosure. We've always been a fan. We always have. I think even before you knew him. Oh yeah, there's no way we're ever gonna be objective about this whiskey. Wow, there's like a dried fruity, what is that? Like a dried cranberries. Yep. Dried cranberries and. Almost, but now, but now as it airs out, you get Distant mosquito. <laughs> to fully appreciate the whiskey. Oh, I lost a ring. <laughs> I guess it's colder in here than it is outside. Maybe you're getting old and thin and frail. Yeah. Oh, I can't. The whiskey is eating my bones. <laughs> There's this, this like oak smoke down, or, or mesquite smoke, like hint wispy in yeah, the background. But that dried fruity sweetness, mm -hmm. that is, man, it's very scotchy to me. Yeah. That dried fruit. Good coming. night. That smells good. I haven't even tasted it yet, but I'm really excited about it. I'm so, I'm excited too. Already pissed off that it's in a small bottle. Oh, I know. I'm just gonna. If I ever meet him, it's gonna be like the first thing I say to him. He goes, "Hi, my name's Colin Keegan. What's with the small bottle, Colin?" <laughs> <laughs> or if I pronounce the name that Daniel would say, yeah, it would be Colin. Colin. <laughs> It's not Colin Kagan. Yeah, what's the? It's Colin the, Keegan, Daniel, come on. I just really want to have to be a part of that conversation. <laughs> I'm like, what's with the small bottle, Colin? <laughs> <laughs> but the way you delivered it is very like Napoleon Dynamite. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh my God. Come on, that's delicious. I was laughing when I tried it, and so I lost the first impression. Wow. That lived up to the nose beautifully. Mm. Pot Damn. steel. Damn. That's, it's pot steel, obviously. That is approachable. The you know what? 
the mesquite hint it's subtle it's so minor yeah because some of the other repeated uh, mesquite ones that we have from them mm -hmm. uh, are really smoky yeah really smoky yeah, yeah, yeah. this is gonna be frustrating for a lot of people Good night. It's frustrating to me because it's a small bottle colin colin <laughs> colin uh, but you said this was like uh, a limited release yeah. anniversary. They're not going to have a lot. Right. Probably just available in the distillery, maybe. Probably. I was trying to look for a number on like how many they released. Man. They only did 100 cases. So 1,200 bottles. Mm. And you had to get a mm. ticket to get a chance to buy a bottle. Like a, like hey, a lottery ticket. Let's make stuff like that. I know. Do right? that. I know, right? So go tell Emma to just... We already are. Honestly, that shit that we're the working teller, on right now is on its way there. But I want this now, though. Oh. So you want four-year-old whiskey? This is 10-year anniversary. You want four-year-old whiskey right now? No, I want 10-year anniversary, anniversary right whiskey. now. Yeah. That's and then we can go... Before, yeah. Talk about hyper-aging. <laughs> no, just just do it good. Just move just do it forward good. and... That seems legit. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying do it good. Now. I don't see how that could possibly I'm go wrong. I'm just saying, do, do it, it good, as right, good and as cheap. The, as good as this. Yeah. Right now. And cheaply. Yes. Right well, now. Well, I don't just say cheaply. It doesn't have to be cheaply. Oh, because you can only have two things out yeah. of the three. So fast and good. Yeah, but don't do it cheap. Spend uh, all your money. Yeah, and invent time travel. No, <laughs> nobody's saying invent time travel. I'm just saying, have it here now. <laughs> <laughs> This, this actually, this is probably going to be in one of my top 10 American whiskeys. Just oh, like yeah. that. Like that. This Just is, this one. Yes. Period. This, this bottling. This is exceptional, exceptional. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Goodness. You know what? He would. He should be a household name, but it's just rude to throw around the term col like colon. Colon? <laughs> yeah. Just, well, if he would change his name from something other than colon. It would probably get a little bit more leverage. You, you know how many people you've probably caused to pronounce it Cole Kagan? Pro well, probably. Like thousands of people are around. Oh, yeah, yeah. This, and you know what? I wonder if it's frustrating like, to them to have people walk in and go, oh, I'm going to try something like Cole Kagan. The, the, it's like, why is everybody saying Cole Kagan? <laughs> <laughs> the generosity of Colin. Colin Keegan. Yeah. The generosity of Colin. He'll never corrected you. If, he's never corrected me. <laughs> if I am wrong, he's never corrected me. Uh, but my generosity does no, not exist. That's true. You're wrong as you feel bad. Yeah. Also, I want this now. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. That's make. I've got that part. It's super good. fully got good. that. So, yeah. so wow. I think you having as much work as you need to do today. You probably don't. No, need, no. Oh. Don't need. Mm -hmm. Oh, you did really kind of. <laughs> you did kind of. Damn it. Oh, here. Let me hold I can't that. Put it in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> These little tight jeans. Yeah, yeah. Woo! On Work, the six. Working it, R.J. Jackson. <laughs> Yeah. What was the whiskey like in medieval renaissance eras? Oh, yeah. I edited his comment for brevity. So, bonus points. If you can name a commercially available spirit, that would be close. No. no. I think it's probably going to be closer to like a... It's going to be Moon new, new Make. Yeah, New Make. And honestly, if you can find Puccine... This is called Puccine. Uh, then that's going to be the closest thing you're going to get to something way back in the day, which was mm -hmm. New Make spirit, pot stilled, mm -hmm. probably only once... And then with things added to it to make sure, make it taste better. Oh my god! Damn. <sighs> what? Do you? No, I, I didn't. You took all ah. of mine. Here, Gee, here, damn it. here, 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 here. Just a little. That's good. Save it for the test. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Save it for the test. Daniel. Don't spend it all in one place, kid. Here's a quarter. <laughs> Daniel Kremit. Uh, hypothetical question. Let's say you're drinking in an area that might frown upon people openly drinking. Mm. Kids, Little League game, a park, a sporting <laughs> event where they don't want you to bring in your own liquor. How do you oh, drink? Yeah. That's what a little flasks are for, man. No, no, because a flask is obvious. No. You, yes. Long sleeve shirt. You put it in there and you just go. I've got a better one. Or the in straw come up through your shirt. Insulated coffee in, mugs. Into the flask. Oh, okay. I do it all the time. I did it all the time. Right. Kids elementary school play. Right. 10 in the morning. Yeah. I have to sit here for an hour listening to other kids perform random sh so that my kid gets his 10 right. seconds of right. like right. saying half of a line. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That one was always hot cocoa mm -hmm. and bourbon. Mm -hmm. And the in the evening events, it's just straight whiskey. Yeah. But it's just in a coffee thing. We just pop the lid back and just don't ever leave it open. 
Yeah. Because that's, you can smell it. So that is, kids are great and wonderful. I love my children. Mm -hmm. uh, so, uh, school functions and events and plays and mm -hmm. recitals and whatever. It's like, okay, I get it. Just whenever your kid's playing, you can't, you know, just, he's done. Peace. Peace you out, all these other kids. Yeah. But, 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 you know, all the other kids and classmates, you want to be. But sitting through all of the other grades? Oh, yeah. Jeez. A like whole maybe, school production? Yeah. It's yeah. like, no, it's, I think I don't need to be here. This program's going to take two hours. Yeah. Your really, kid doesn't know anybody in 90% of the right, performance. In, in like his grade and his class, they're doing a thing, and it's like 20, 30 minutes. I'm game, for, I'm game for 20, 30 minutes. Yeah. But yeah. I love my kids. Yeah. Don't love your kids. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. Uh, here's the fighting, steal your drink. If you fight me, you fight for a friend. You steal me, you steal your lover, sir. And if you drink, may you, you drink, drink with us. us. Pretty smart. <laughs>